Now that your students have been certified and nominated for Greenlight Match, you may be wondering what's next. When universities begin making admissions decisions and admitting your students, you will also receive email notifications. When you log in from your home screen, you'll be able to see an overview of all of your students and the acceptances that they've received. The best way you're able to support your students as they're receiving acceptances through Greenlight Match is to monitor the student responses. If you remember from your initial training, when universities send offers of admission to students, their profiles are anonymous. And students will remain anonymous to universities unless they respond to their offers. So from your home screen, you'll be able to see if students have indicated they are interested in their offers. You'll be able to see if they've indicated they are not interested in their offers. And finally, you'll be able to monitor if students have not yet responded to their offers. If you see students have offers that if they have not responded to, that's a great opportunity to check in with them and see if they have any questions. The deadline that you see from your home screen is not a deposit deadline. This is the student response deadline. This is the final day that a student can respond to their Greenlight Match acceptance. Remember, unless the student responds, the university is not able to access the information they require to issue the acceptance package. You get to see the overview from your home screen. And if you click into your students tab, students will have a new tab appear in their profile once they've begun receiving university acceptances. You'll be able to review this information in the admissions tab. You'll see the universities that have offered admission, program information, and any merit-based scholarships. In the tab next door, you'll be able to see the conversation the student is having with any university that's offered them admission. This is a great place for students to ask questions, and you can chime in here as well. It's a three-way conversation. But the important thing to remember is to make sure that students are responding to their offers if they would like to have these options available to them in the future. Responding is not committing. Clicking interested is not a commitment to that university. It is merely the next step to unlock all of their account details so that that university is able to issue an official offer letter.